Now, if you're going through something, that's when your hastening gets stronger and greater. Because you know that you need to get to Him. Because if you don't, you don't know how you're going to make it through what you're in. Anybody came to church this morning not to play with it? You didn't come for form or fashion, didn't come to be seen. But you came because you needed to hasten to his throne. Hallelujah. Because you know it was at the throne, at the foot of Jesus, where your answer's gonna come, your breakthrough's gonna come, your joy's gonna come, your peace is gonna come, your power is gonna come. Hallelujah. And since you're here, you might as well hasten through his, to his throne. If you need prayer this morning, I want you to make your way to the altar. If you need prayer this morning, want to make your way to the altar. Hasten to his throne, hasten to his throne, hasten to it. Quiet, don't back up, thank you so much. Hasten to his throne, hasten to his throne, hasten to his throne, hasten to his throne, hasten to his throne. And once you get there, and once you get here, can you look at somebody and say, I needed to be here. For someone who's going through problems at home, God is telling you today that he's working out that family situation. Prodigal sons and daughters do come back home. Marriages can be straightened out. Whatever people are going through, we want to say thank you, Holy Ghost. You're going to take us through. So on today, we give your name the praise. On today, we say thank you. On today, we glorify you. And on today, we believe there are breakthroughs in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus we pray. Amen. Amen. And amen. 